For most of Earth's history, the planet did not belong to dinosaurs. Forests spread unchecked, rivers carved ancient floodplains, and the land was ruled by creatures almost no one remembers today. Crocodile-like predators dominated the rivers. Massive armored reptiles moved slowly across the land. They were powerful, perfectly adapted, and for millions of years, they controlled the world. Early mammals survived by hiding. They were small, fast, mostly nocturnal. Every sound meant danger. Every step could mean death. This was a world that rewarded strength, not speed or flexibility. Dinosaurs already existed, but at first, they barely mattered. They were small, rare, easily overlooked among the giants that ruled the land. At watering holes and feeding grounds, dinosaurs were pushed aside. They lost territory, lost food, lost confrontations. Nothing about them suggested they would one day dominate the planet. Then the planet began to change. Volcanoes split the land apart. Ash filled the skies. Temperatures swung wildly. The stable world the old rulers depended on was disappearing. The great reptiles began to fail. Drought spread. Ecosystems collapsed. Once dominant species vanished, one by one. Power was no longer enough to survive. Dinosaurs endured because they were different. They grew quickly, moved efficiently, adapted to changing conditions. They didn't need a perfect world. They needed a flexible one. As the old rulers disappeared, space opened across the planet. And for the first time in Earth's history, the world belonged to dinosaurs. The age of dinosaurs had begun.